hello guys welcome to my channel this is Ron Ron I hope everyone is having a wonderful day and keeping safe during this times with the pandemic thank you guys for taking time to watch this video and today I am going to make a full makeup video just my usual routine um, when I go to the office so let's start guys I Riley's here guys I just got back from my play date <laughs> he went to our neighbor's house to play and he went at um what time 10 o'clock and he's just back it's already 5 30 in the afternoon so say hi Riley hi see you later <laughs> so that was Riley guys he's gonna go downstairs so let's start guys the first step that I do is I moisturize my face and I use this Clinique Drama Dramatically Different Moisturizing Gel. This is a gel hydratant. And this is a new tube that I opened so that's why the, the pump wasn't working very well the first time I used it. Don't forget your neck. And now I'm going to put on the foundation. So today I'm using the Estee Lauder Double Wear Nude Water Fresh Makeup. So this is a foundation. It says Shake Well. It's water-based, guys. So uh, just a little. And then I will just use the sponge the sponge that I'm using guys is a little damp with water para easier to spread it works better for me when the sponge is a little damp because sometimes your face go is dry so our next step guys is our concealer so ito yung ginagamit ko na concealer yung Revlon Color Stay Prep and Protect this is actually a primer or a base but it works well for me when I use it as a as a concealer yung primer guys on my um, as a concealer itatap ko siya ng, ng concealer talaga na ginagamit ko ang concealer na ginagamit ko is yung um, Dior Forever Undercover gumawa na din ako ng video about this guys and if you wanna look at that video just click the link up here so you can see yung testing and unboxing ko of this Dior Skin Forever Undercover Concealer. So na blend ko na guys yung concealer na nilagay ko. Um, I don't put so much concealer at the start because gagawin pa natin yung eyes natin. Then after, we'll, double, we'll clean it up through a concealer. So let's start with the eyes guys with our um, eyeshadow. So, in this today, guys, gumamit ako ng eyeliner. Ang gagamitin ko na lang is a darker shade, which is this one, Privacy. Gagawin ko siyang eyeliner.
medyo thick yung pagkalagay ko guys kasi di ba nga our use our new normal ngayon is magwear tayo ng mask so yung concentration talaga ng ating makeup ay dapat sa eyes kasi yun lang yung nakikita and then dito na tayo sa ating second layer so i'm going to use this one it's called young love Lumampas ako ng konti guys sa crest para ma-emphasize siya. Medyo dark kasi itong pigmented siya. Medyo dark yung Urban Decay. Meaning very pigmented siya pag nilagay mo siya. Pero easy naman siya to blend. So okay lang kahit marami kang malagay. You can clean it up by blending. So, ang third layer, guys, na ilalagay natin should be yung lighter na shade. This one. Mix of this one and this one. It's called Hot Spot and Caution. Dito. Lalagay natin dito to shape. Dapat lighter siya para ma-shape niya yung kilay natin. Ito guys, favorite ko tala to yung angled foundation na brush. Kasi madali siyang i-define yung kilay. So I just use the hot spot again. A lighter. Na shade. Actually, pwede nyo din gamitin yung powder nyo. So after I put the products guys, yung, yung sabi natin kanina na first, second, and third layer at saka yung paglagay natin ng lighter which is the hot spot nilagay natin dito to define the kilay what I do is I use this setting brush and then I blend everything For my kilay guys, I always use this Jordana Shape and Tame. You can, I think you can buy this from Watson's. Here in Cayman, I get it from the supermarket. They have it sa section nila sa mga toiletries. There's a corner there kung saan yung makikita yung mga nail cutter. Andoon din ito. And this shade that I'm using is Brunette. I use this guys because I feel kasi when I use the black one, yung black na color, masyadong nagiging thick yung kilay ko. So, medyo it looks unnatural pag I use the black color. So, when I found this color and I tried it, okay naman siya. So that's what I use, the brunette, the brunette shade for the kilay. So our next step, guys, is contouring. So what I use when I contour is a darker shade of powder. I use the MAC Studio Fix, and this is the darker shade of what I usually use na color ng powder. And then I just get my this um, MAC Professional Makeup Brush. I think this one is a contouring brush, if I'm not mistaken. And for the nose, guys, to blend, I just use an eyeshadow blending brush and since we're finished now with the eyeshadow and the key light I will now put my third layer of concealer So now I'm going to put on 
the powder. For our blush on, we are using the MAC. This is an old MAC blush on that I have. It's called Love Joy. It's a neutralized blush by MAC. And it's really good because it's, it blends really well. Pigmented siya guys. So, pag nilagay mo siya, medyo luma na siya actually. Ang blush on ko na to. Siguro 10 years. Pinigay pa to ng mga friends ko when I was in Bermuda. I think on my 29th birthday. But my point is, sobrang tagal na siya, pero pigmented pa din siya. So, ayan guys, tiba sabi ko kanina, medyo masyado siyang light dahil marami yung nilagay ko na concealer. Pero now, na nalagyan na siya ng blush, it looks better na. Hindi na masyadong pale yung mukha ko from the foundation and from the concealer. Maglalagay din tayo konti dito sa dito sa forehead para natural naman yung look and then i-blend lang siya medyo super red siya for now pero pag na-blend na siya it will look natural na and what we're aiming here guys is yung tinatawag nila na drunk blush so padadaanan lang natin sa may ilong yung blush on na nilagay natin parang sun-kissed siya. Pansin nyo guys, hindi masyadong contour ang aking face dahil medyo round. So, ang ginagawa ko is the same shade nung ginamit na contour sa nose at saka sa cheeks. Eto, gagawin natin dito sa jaw. Para lang medyo defined yung ating jaw. At huwag natin kakalimutan lagi guys, itong ating mas um, eyelashes curler. It works wonders talaga. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight pumps. And then sa kabila... So, yung huling step natin, guys, is of course, ang ating lipstick. So, magsisimula tayo lagi sa lip gloss when we do our lips. Ayan. Moisturize, moisturize, moisturize. Laging ka... Laging tatandaan yan, guys. I-moisturize natin ang ating lips. And then, lip liner. And after putting the lip gloss and then the lip liner, now, eto na gagamitin na natin ang lipstick that we're using for today. It's Infallible Pro Matte Liquid Lipstick. It's super red. Hindi pa pala last step yun guys, yung ating lipstick. Meron pa pala tayong nak nakalimutan yung highlighter. So, lalagay na tayo ng highlighter. And we will use our highlighter blush. So, I'm using this Dior highlighter. So, ito na ang ating finished look, guys. So, I hope you enjoy this video wherever you are in the world. I hope you're having a wonderful day and keep safe laggy, guys. Sending you love from this side of the world. As always, be kind and love one another.